Hey there, Pisces. Hope you're doing well, friend. We are checking in for your energies. The dominant, most dominant will be sun, moon, and rising, but it is for any Pisces placement. Love that you're here. I'm really feeling called to just pump out some readings for you guys. I'm not sure what's happening with the energy, but I want to look at what's happening with your person or per person of interest. Um, specific person, whatever that may be. So let's see, uh, check in to their energies, how they're feeling, how they're feeling about you, the advice and things like that. So let's take a peek in at your person's energy. Your person's energy for Pisces. Okay. Let's, how does this person feel? Okay, Six of Pentacles, King of Cups. So whoever's on your mind right now. Okay. So it seems like they were giving to this situation. Um, had deep feelings here. And then maybe disappeared um, or withdrew with the Six of Pentacles, King of Cups, the Hermit. Let's see where this is going in terms of their energy. So there's some communication is going to come in. Someone may want to clear the air, but they're feeling a little bit doubtful here. Let's have a look. Knight of Swords. Yeah, I, uh, uh, this seems pretty straightforward in how this person's feeling right now. Um, yeah, I, I feel like someone was giving to a situation here and then... Um, there were feelings, express feelings perhaps, and then I don't know what happened. You withdrew, they withdrew, something happened here. But in terms of their energy, it's like they want to communicate with you, perhaps clear things up, um, you know, share something, um, ask, you know, see if there's a potential fresh start to start communicating. But this person's feeling a little bit stuck in that energy, if that's the case, um, or they're a little bit doubtful whether you will receive this message or how you will receive this message um, and whether or not you're actually going to be interested or if you're just like, um, yeah, no thanks. Um, I don't know. Maybe they're thinking you're happy without them. But we do have the King of Pentacles energy. Yeah, they're definitely in conflict around something here. Maybe they're, they're recognized, you know, not having you around or whatever happened between you. They're not feeling too great about they're, they're thinking about you a lot here. They're definitely thinking about you a lot here. Let's dive in a little bit further on the action they want to take towards you. Okay, they're, they're feeling the loss here. I think they're feeling a bit of regret. Um, and maybe even looking at their actions or behaviors here that w weren't too healthy or, you know, whether it's theirs, whether it's yours. Uh, in terms of the action towards Pisces... Wow. Wanting to come together. Shimmer on this devil. Wow. So they're really intensely thinking about this. Um, five of cups. What do I need to know about this five of cups? Yeah, they're not happy that you guys aren't talking or in communication, but you're probably also, I'm guessing Pisces thinking this person's not interested, but that's not the case. This person's really thinking about how, how do I get this new beginning here? What do we need to know about the two of cups? Yeah, this person, I think, is reflecting on what you guys had or how how to how to reinvest here. What can we expect from this person towards Pisces? They want to take a chance here. What else do we need to know about this? Got the full energy with the star, the moon, and the magician. What do we need to know about this star energy? Yeah. They're definitely feeling the pressure here. What do we need to know about this fool? Yeah. It's like that... It's like they're stuck right now in between their thoughts and what potentially can happen 
to, I just need to make this call. I just need to take this step forward, you know, and hoping that the energy will be potentially reciprocal or hoping that, you know, I'll just know, I'll just know whether or not there's any chance here, any hope here. What do we need to know about the moon energy? They want to come together here. They want to work together here. This person might even be surprised in themselves. Maybe they've done everything to try and keep themselves busy. Um, share more on what we need to know that's going on here. We've got the Queen of Wands and the Ace of Pentacles. What is this Queen of Wands energy that we need to... Um, I'm going to get another deck. I want to see if there's another energy around that you need to be aware of. Because, you know, the moon energy can be what someone is hiding. I don't know if someone has a commitment or has, you know, gone back with someone else here or is having a fresh start with someone else or you are the queen of wands represented here and they want commitment with you and they want to offer a commitment with you. But it's something that they're thinking about they're keeping to themselves maybe intuitively you feel this but you can't see it and it's like they want to present it to you that's what i keep getting is they want to present it to you but they're i don't know what's going on here they're not seeming to to move forward share more on this hierophant energy yeah they're feeling your loss friend they're feeling the loss here and again you've got the star energy i don't know if you're dealing with an aquarius and then you've got the Queen of Wands again. So they're seeing you as someone that they're very attracted to. They're seeing someone who's in their power right now. Um, and that's probably what they're concerned about, right? Is that, are you going to accept their offer? What else do we need to know about this Ace of Pentacles? Yeah, they're not, they're not sure whether they should. That's the thing. What else do we need to know with this High Priestess energy? I don't know what's going on, but I think the two of you are kind of feeling a similar way. I don't know if you've, you've dreamt about this person. I don't know what you're connecting into with this person. Um, but with this page of wands, it seems to be again, that they want to communicate, but they're connecting into, should I do this? Shouldn't I do this? Maybe there's something they want to share with you. Let's see what they want to communicate about. I think they're thinking of you and this connection, the commitment here, like letting this go. Yeah. They're, they're really looking here. It's like, Oh, you're fine on your own. Are you? I think this person didn't realize the impact that you would have on them. A lot of fire energy here. So you've got the sun and the king of wands. Um, you've got obviously queen of wands twice. So this person, I think feels you know, you guys had a good thing. You, you worked really well together, right? You both had, I don't know, something that I felt like just made sense in terms of this, the way that you communicated, the way that you connected, the way that um, you guys just worked together. I think your values, like a lot was aligned is what I feel like, okay, when it comes to um, that energy. What's their intention here? Wow. Their intention is to come forward and communicate and talk to you and try and get this back on track. You know what? Oh, my heart is, it's interesting connecting into this energy. It's like, I feel this person, they, as much, I think initially they may have been fine just with whatever happened. Maybe like I said, withdrawing or that's how it's come across. But I think ultimately you may be feeling and mirroring similarly each other, but I think there's something happening to the masculine here that's awakening and acknowledging like I made a choice, 
but did I make the right choice now? That's how I'm getting the masculine made. Uh, masculine, yeah, in terms of what the masculine did and made, they're really thinking about this um, a lot. They're, they're very much feeling sad that you guys aren't connected and they're looking at how do I heal this? How do I... How do I approach this to get reconnected? How do I approach this to balance this out? How do I show investment? To, I don't know. I feel like this person wants to repair, but may not know how. I think there's concern that you've just moved on and, you, and, and you're happy now or that, um, I don't know. It's kind of like, but their intent is to connect with you and talk with you. Look, you've got the tower on the bottom. Two of Swords, Three of Cups, Four of Pentacles, Knight of Swords, King of Cups, Four of Cups, The Devil. Like this person is really in their head, really in their head. What's the potential outcome here in terms of this connection? I'm going to get another deck. You know what? Let me see if they want to say something to you first. I wish I had my other decks here, but I don't have them. They'll be arriving soon. Um, what does this person want to say to Pisces? Wow. So you've got the Ace of Materials and the Temperance Energy. They want to figure out how to make this work out. But I think, again, that they... They also know when they come in that they're coming in strong and solid. And I think a big part of this is like they're taking their time because I think they're a bit slower in decision making. And I feel a decision if they made to leave was done like that. And that's not normally how they make decisions. Um, is how it feels like. So I feel you're heavily on their mind or they're heavily feeling I, I like I what, what have I got to do? Like I feel attached to this person. I didn't feel like I was going to be feeling this way. I don't think someone has made this person feel this way in a very long time. And I think they're surprised in themselves on how they're feeling and they want to come in to apologize or connect. Um, yeah, this person feels like they're meant to, to be with you. I want to, I think they want to see if this is reciprocated. Can we talk about this? Can we have a fresh start with this? They, they either want to come towards you. I don't know if you had plans to travel or go travel together or move or relocate, but something about wanting to travel or again this you got the page of wands the page of wands keeps coming out which is about wanting to talk to you about this what do they want to say again they want to take a chance forward here with you talk to you connect with you with potential plans what do they want to say to Pisces? It's interesting with this energy, it's saying, I wish you would trust in me. Because I can't let go of wanting this new beginning with you. But is it too late? While it's clear to me, are you even interested? Are you even wanting to move this way? Are you wanting to work together? Can we make this work? Because this is really bothering me. I'm trying to be okay, but this is really bothering me. Yeah, I'm not doing I'm not doing okay <laughs> without you here right now. Um, I thought I'd be okay, but I'm not I'm 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 actually probably suffering a little bit in silence and I didn't expect that. 
No, oh, again. Yep. They're suffering from the ending here. They're really reflecting at the loss of the ending. Well, what, what do you expect, buddy? Or Sheila? Isn't it funny? Sometimes we make decisions and it can just change everything. And then it's just like, what the fudge? Oh, okay. Let's have a look at the, the potential outcome here and what we need to know. The potential outcome between the, this connection. You know what? Actually, I'm going to get some... In case we have some cross watches here, what they feel back in return. Let's get some messages for what our crew here feels back in return. How does Pisces feel in return and what do they want to say? I feel that this you know, you got, you may have been like, I think this is my person. I feel pretty clear on this is my person. Um, or you're reflecting on some thoughts or logically trying to look at what happened here. You're trying to make sense of it. But I also feel the King of Swords is very clear um, in how they think. And the Six of Cups, you know, could be reconciliation, past energy, past memories. So there's some reflection here. Could be soulmate energy. Let's get a little more. Queen of Wands. Yeah. The, whether it's the feminine or whether it's just Pisces in general, um, here it's like... I feel like you're just trying to make sense of what happened and... In addition to that, it's you also felt connected to this situation. I think there was a lot of attraction here. I don't know if there's an air energy that you, that you were dealing with um, or a fire energy that you were dealing with, but I do feel like there was chemistry and connection here. There was an attraction, um, but I do feel like Pisces does want to heal this, um, does want to make this right. Um, is working on themselves at the same time but I do feel that there's healing that 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 is desired ultimately for this connection look queen of swords and the hermit energy is trying to make sense of like why why just do that why just why just withdraw and I think that's the thing is that naturally what eventually happens is someone turns their back right because what are they supposed to do if you withdraw? So what's the intent or action for Pisces? Communicate is what they're being asked. So Pisces is saying back, if there's cross watchers here, please like communicate with me. I'm, I'm, I'm waiting for it. If you want to heal this, that's what you need to do. Because whatever happened is BS. <laughs> we kind of need to you know, get real on what happened here because I'm pretty good at doing my thing and, and moving on if that's what I need to do. But I do feel that there's something more here. Yeah. And see, and this is the thing is I do believe that you, intuitively, you know, that there's more here, but you can only go with what you see, right? You can only go with what, how someone's behaving and, I feel a part of this is not really making sense, but you, but you make sense of it. It's like, well, this person isn't either talking to me anymore or has cut, you know, has just disappeared, whatever it might be. But there's also this part of like, you believe that they are going to communicate. Maybe there's a part of, you know, maybe you feel that they're watching you or looking, um, to heal this as well. Like there's some, I don't know. I feel like you guys are really mirroring each other. But there's definitely deep feelings here. There's definitely deep feelings. So let's see where this connection is going. Where's this connection going? Healing, rest and rejuvenation. Magician in the mirror. The temple path. Someone's going through a bit of a spiritual journey. Um, 
This is good, whatever that is. I feel like this is more the... Well, I think both of you are. Like I said, I think you're mirroring each other. But I'm also getting to this to be to come out on the other side of success, coming out the other side of learning, growing and heading into the right path and direction or succeeding and whatever that is or whatever that looks like for you or for this situation. So I'm going to leave that there with you, friend. Feel welcome to put comments below. I'd love to hear how you feel and connect with this and I'll speak to you soon. Bye now.